In this session, let's learn about temporary table space management. We know temporary table spaces are used to manage space for database sort operations. And also they are used to store your global temporary tables. Let's take an example. Whenever you join two large tables and the Oracle database cannot find enough memory in the RAM, then it allocates space in this temporary table space. Okay, all the sort operations which require lot of temporary data for sorting is stored in the temporary table space. Okay, if you think about it, whenever Oracle database performs distinct order by, group by, union, all kind of set operators or even your sort merge join, Oracle database generates lot of temporary data and that is exactly where your temporary table space is used. Okay, let's see what is the temporary table space available in the Oracle database. Okay, let's remember this data dictionary table dba underscore temp files. Okay, okay, from here let's select table space name the file name the bytes okay let's divide by 124 and 1024 so that we can get uh, in megabytes and let's check the status dba temp files okay we have one table space and it's called temp this is the temporary table space and the file name is tmp01.dbf and it's 20 MB and the status is online. Okay, let's increase it to 30. Okay, how can we do that? It is alter database temp file. Instead of data file, you need to mention temp file. Okay, and let me copy this. and let me paste it here and resize it to 30 so it successfully altered so now when I run this you see now the size is 30 MB what if you want to create one more temporary table space it is very easy it is create temporary table space since we are creating a temporary table space we just need to mention the keyword temporary if it was a regular table space we need not mention this keyword and after that i want to give it as temp1 and i want it to be under this2 prod1 data temp 02dbf and I want to give the size as 10. Oops, I missed a keyword temp file. Okay, so let me do this again. Create temporary table space temp1 and then temp file and then let me copy the rest. Okay, you see we created a new temporary table space. So now let me run this SQL statement. Okay, we have two temporary table spaces. For some users, you can assign TEMP as a temporary table space and for some users, you can assign temp1 as a temporary table space. Okay. Let's see which is the default temporary table space. For that, I'll use the data dictionary table database underscore properties. Okay, so I will do select star from database properties where property name like it should be in capitals. Okay, table space. Okay, you see here, temp is the 
default temporary table space that means if you don't assign any temporary table space for a table or for a user by default it will use the temp table space in the same way the default permanent table space is users that means if you don't specify the table space when creating the table or materialized view or any other object by default it will use the users table space how can we change the default temporary table space can we do that yes we can do that it's as easy as alter database default temporary table space so I want it to be temp1 so it's altered so now let's run this SQL statement and you see now temp1 is the name of your default temporary table space cool right in the next session let's learn how to create table space groups okay